Hi, this is Michael Buffer, and uh, let's get ready for EJ Boxing Live. EJ Boxing Live here. EJ Boxing Live here. How do you, you feel coming to London? Obviously, how you feel Leroy's going to do in the fifth um, fight tomorrow? I'm feeling uh, really good about Leroy. We've been having um, a great camp. Uh, we had a great stay here in, in London. Everything's been coming together right up into the weigh-ins. He's feeling really good. He's excited. I'm happy. And um, we're ready to fight. Uh, you've only been with him a short time. What kind of things have you been working on like, um, working on, uh, for him to upset? Because uh, Leroy's a counterpuncher. Um, how's he going to upset um, the style of of Joe Joyce is very aggressive. Well, um, I don't think that Lenroy is a counter puncher. No, as much no, I don't. As much as I think Lenroy is more of a boxer puncher, but uh, we got some things that we're planning on doing on Saturday night that um, will give him some advantages if he's able to uh, take advantage of the tactics and the strategy that we're ready. You know, we want to use. So uh, I feel very confident that he'll do that. Absolutely, I put my money down already last week. So Lenroy, yeah, yeah, I did. This if, if I win, Lenroy got a lot of money. He's a massive underdog over here. They, they favor Joe Joyce for win, so you know what I mean. I've put some money down. I know you're a gambling guy as well. So uh, nah, nah, <laughs> you know what I'm, I'm, not, I'm not the gambling guy, but nah. that's good to hear. That's yeah. good to hear because yeah. I love being the underdog. Yeah, you know what I mean, I, I enjoy that. That's uh, you know that's the story of my life. So Lenroy's been the same way. He's he's always been the underdog as well. So this is nothing new to him. All right, man. I wouldn't be remiss if I didn't talk about your son. Um, I interviewed your son just before he fought. Um, Devil Alexander, uh -huh. and he was telling me how there's many ways of beating Devil Alexander. He lost many ways, and obviously uh, the way obviously you, you and your son think, you dissect your uh, opponent weaknesses and then you go and attack them. Now for going forward, Sean Porter they're talking about Danny Garcia. Yeah. What's the possibility of that fight happening? It's very possible. It's gonna happen. Um, just uh, you know, a matter of uh, dotting the eyes, crossing the T's, uh, the date, time, and the, and the venue. So uh, you know, hopefully here uh, in the next few days when I get back to New York after I leave uh, the UK I'm going straight to New York and we'll have a meeting in regards to that yeah absolutely as well obviously um, your son lost to um, Kel Brook is there a possibility in the future to try and revenge that because I know you always want to get that one no absolutely not no? because as you would know since you live here Kel Brook has never mentioned Sean Porter's name so he's never wanted to rematch Sean yeah that's never been something he wanted to do um, we would you know we would love it we'd love to come over and fight Oh right, well, hey, listen, hey, hey, hope Lemroy does very well. Great see you in the UK, and, 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 and good luck on, on tomorrow. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. EJ Boxer live here with Lemroy Thomas, obviously fighting Joe Joyce here tomorrow. The Hey Belly thing. How you feeling? How's training been going? Great, man. Yeah. In the best shape of my life. Absolutely, yeah. I'm representing Jamaica. I mean, my parents are from Jamaica as well. It's good to see another fellow Jamaican. The last Jamaican, the last Jamaican I know to do some do some good is um, obviously Mike McCallan and obviously Lewis. Nicholas Waters. Yeah, Lynx Lewis. So how do you feel proud to represent Jamaica and have the Commonwealth belt? I bleed it, man. Green, gold, and black. I bleed it. Good to represent my people. Yeah. So how how you spend? Are you, are you you feel like say obviously you know Jojo is hard test. Do you feel like you're gonna retain your championship? Life is hard test. Yeah. Joe test. Is, jo, Joe is just a man. Yeah. The hard test is life. You know the everyday battle. <laughs> Just a man. So you do in your in your mind, yeah, you see nothing but you see victory. Victory all the way. Yeah. That's it. I didn't come all the way across the pond. Not not to come over here and get a victory because. Oh, I, I, you're a massive underdog. I put money on my I put money on myself. You're like a 10, 10 to fifteen or ten to one fifty. Yeah, whatever it is, I'm gonna look against Dave Allen. I shook the odds. Yep, definitely. This is God's plan, man. I didn't roll this destiny. God did. I'm just fulfilling. Absolutely. So, give a message to your fan homes at, in Jamaica. Right, look at the camera. Yo, everybody back home, man, going through the struggle. Let's keep it fit. Zin, and all of me yard monsters in the air, we don't want to ship back. We can't ship, we're going away. Because we're large. You understand? So, I'm going to pick up on the self, one love, and jobless. Zin? Yeah? yeah? Thanks very much, champ. Good luck on Saturday. <laughs> Hi, this is Michael Buffer, and uh, let's get ready for EJ Boxing Live. EJ Boxing Live here. EJ Boxing Live here.